3938 Delta Kilo Executive Tower Fly Runway Heading, Runway 25 at Alpha 2, cleared for takeoff, wind 2505. Runway heading, clear up for 258 Delta Kilo. Number 8 Delta Kilo, turn right, just a heading of 310. 310 for 8 Delta Kilo. 8 Delta Kilo, remain outside of the Bravo and frequency change approved. Have a safe flight. What's that for Delta Kilo? Affirmative, just remain outside of the Bravo and you can frequency change. Have a safe flight. Okay, thank you very much. Outside the Bravo, frequency change approved. Uh, 8 Delta Kilo. Apopka uh, traffic. Uh, Cherokee 908 Delta Kilo. We are about uh, seven miles uh, south. Uh, we've uh, dropped a couple cylinders out. We need to uh, come in priority to the airport. What airport was the one reporting the cylinders you lost cylinders on the airplane? Does someone have an emergency at Apopka? Yeah, we're not going to make uh, the airport. Uh, we're uh, turning for a field. Bob Traffic Warrior, uh, Zero Town Charlie's going to turn southbound or eastbound to find that aircraft. Make sure they're fine. They're over Popka. And uh, 5894 Mike Alpha will help scan for that traffic too. Anyone has sight on that, that aircraft that went down? Popka Traffic, we're still looking for him. We're just east in the field. You guys just said somebody went down? Yeah, somebody lost an engine went down. You guys know the cell number? Mm -hmm. Negative at the moment, Joel. I don't have something yet. And Apopka traffic, uh, Warrior Zero Tango Charlie's orbiting just to the south of Apopka at 1,000, looking for the aircraft that went down. Anybody got eyes on the aircraft? Uh, negative, not yet. Still looking. Did you hear his transmission when he went down? Based on what I saw on ADSB, if it was the one I was watching that kept on descending, it's over on the uh, southeast side of. Uh, uh, a popka near the where all that construction is being done. Roger. But no Julia. Hey guys, I just had somebody pull it up on ADSB. It seems like they uh, pinged out uh, north of Lake Apopka in between X04 and Orlando North. All right, copy that. We'll go over there and look for them over there. And uh, D-Bot Apopka, where did you guys last have them on the ASB? We had them, we thought we saw them over there on the uh, east side of Lake Apopka, or at least the east side of Apopka. Uh, thanks to Ethan, and you pulled it up uh, right away. He said, there was a bank table to the number that went out uh, in between Edgar's Airport and Orlando North. All right, copy that, we'll look around. People at Apopka, if you can touch base with the uh, Diamond people, I thought it was a Diamond. I thought it had a DK or something like that with a tail number. Uh, 894 Mike Alpha, we just contacted Approach and we asked them if they saw anything. They said they were sent some helicopters out to check it out. Yeah, we uh, tried to, um, we were coming on downwind for uh, Zero Tango Charlie and uh, we heard him. He lost two cylinders but couldn't make Apopka. We thought he went down on the uh, southeast side of uh, Lake Apopka in those fields, but we circled there for a while and we couldn't find them. Uh, Pop traffic, uh, is there an aircraft that's down? Yeah, Pop traffic, uh, Warrior Zero Town Charlie. We're going to start heading uh, back eastbound and we're on the uh, north side of Lake Apopka. Apopka traffic, 7 0 Tango Charlie is westbound, north shore of Lake Apopka, and we'll level off 1,000 feet for. Appreciate that. Uh, negative. I think uh, it went down, and uh, we had some people looking out for it, and haven't been able to spot it uh, around Lake Apopka. And uh, people at Apopka from uh, Warrior Zero Tango Charlie, we've been advised that the aircraft went down in the uh, Amazon parking lot, and uh, CD is with them right now.